2014, a Stevens Point family lost their son to a toxic drug mixture while being treated at the Toma VA. He was 35-year-old Jason Simkakoski, and he was a Marine Corps veteran. That's part of the reason why U.S. Senator Tammy Baldwin led a discussion today with the Simkakoski family and other Veterans Affairs workers. Baldwin introduced a bill in honor of Simkakoski, and it was passed in July as part of the Comprehensive Addiction and Recovery Act. That aims to mitigate the country's opioid problem. And at the roundtable today, they talked about opioid prescribing practices and how doctors can better meet the medical needs of veterans. About seeing it all the way through and making sure that um, the, the hope embodied in this legislation um, becomes reality. The Simkakoski family has filed a wrongful death lawsuit against the U.S. government. Last year, the VA's inspector general ruled that deficiencies in care led to Simkakoski's death, and one physician was fired. Well, the DNR wants to make sure.